What's new in MIUI 12 RC7 custom ROM based on MIUI 12 running on the Redmi K20 Pro or the Xiaomi Mi 90 Pro? Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you what is new in MIUI 12 custom ROM, which is based on MIUI 12 running on the Redmi K20 Pro or the Xiaomi Mi 90 Pro. We've been following this ROM since its inception and in case you want to have a look at the features and how the ROM has progressed over time, we have videos for those which can be found in the pinned comment and in the description of this video along with an installation video. The first change you will find in RC7 is that the drivers for the GPU which is your OpenGL and Vulkan have been updated as you can see. The date is now 3.14.20 and these drivers are from Android R or Android 11 developer preview 4. Now as for the benchmark scores with these new drivers, you can find the benchmark scores on your screen right now. Do note that Antutu has been removed from the Play Store and side loading it does not work for me. Next up, they have optimized power management. They have updated system applications which does include your camera app so if you open the camera app and go into more you will have a new option called clone mode what does clone mode do well it basically lets you take pictures of the same object in different positions making it look like a clone and the same applies for videos as well for photographs you can have four shots and for videos you can have two videos and Eventually, Xiaomi's software combines those and keeps the background the same to make it look like a clone picture. We do have a separate dedicated video showing off this new clone feature of MIUI camera, which can again be found in the description of the video and also in the pinned comment. Other than that, they have removed some bloatware, which does include your Xiaomi's Mi bug report application, and they have added back Mi video and the Mi music application the gallery application has also been reverted back to me ui 12 other than that the launcher which comes baked in with this build is not the latest alpha launcher with the new ui and in case you want the one with the new ui which i have loaded on my build right now you can find that in the pinned comment installation is as easy as downloading the apk and installing it and once that is done if you go into settings and then go into home screen tap on home screen one more time you will see that you have a completely new ui of choosing the different options so you can either use the classic style which is your normal style wherein all the applications are on the home screen or you can use the one with application drawer you also have the option of customizing your swipe up on home screen on this same page and once you choose with application drawer tap on ok you have other options which show up which include app suggestions managing your application categories what are the background you're looking for you want a light background a dark background in your application drawer you can also configure the transparency as well and here it is application drawer with transparency set and as for the gestures with this new launcher the full screen gestures are still very smooth no jitters or anything like that and not that they were not good with the previous launcher but they are at the same level of consistency with this new launcher as well and there it is peeps that was a quick video showing off what is new in MIUI 12 rc7 based on MIUI 12 running on the redmi k20 pro or the xiaomi mi 90 pro and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome See you when I see you.